Can I ask you something? All these like memories and timelines. How do you decide what's real? Look around, figure out what you believe is true right now, and just commit to it. Just a quick awareness of, you know, showing how the symbols speak for itself or once you know like what a crystal is corresponding to, you know, what a metal corresponds to and just certain gods or deities, you know what I'm saying, uh, correlate to or correspond to, you get the bigger story. But in this old post on Discord from the book on Lilith, it talks about wearing silver and turquoise stones in order to protect from the, you know, basically to protect the children and protect them from the Lilith energy. Again, with the storyline of Lilith coming in to, you know, uh, take the babies in essence. You know, of course, there's deeper imp implications, but we just talking about this right now. <laughs> Uh, but you see how, like, all right, silver, silver and turquoise is valued by those who's trying to, quote unquote, protect themselves from the Lilith energy. So we could see that certain cultures that highly value silver and turquoise, a.k.a. some of the, you know, like think of the Navajo tribe or some of the indigenous tribes, especially in that New Mexico, Arizona area, you know, specifically more. But, you know, across the board, we don't want to make it again like just one space. But anyway, with the fact that those tribes value silver and turquoise very highly, then one could, you know, say along with other, you know, evidence that, you know, they may not align with the quote unquote Lilith energy on that level, so to speak, you know. Because when you look at other, you know, other cultures, other spiritual traditions, and they don't really vibe with turquoise or silver, then you may, again, see the opposite side of that truth, you know. But just a quick one again, just seeing how the symbols and everything correspond and correlate, you know, that's very important. Because again, from our dreams to being in this more dense dream realm, you know what I'm saying? Understanding the language of symbols is very key and important. But now as the vibrate, y'all know what it is. And again, this is a post from the discard server. It's on my computer screen, so it's kind of... But yep, in the book section.